Hello everybody and welcome back to Hoko Life, where today, look at this misty, 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 foggy, rainy, horrible day. Ew! I think today is definitely a day to be in the mines. It's also a day though, um, I feel very much. I think we might get to summer today, maybe, it might be next episode though. I'd love to see all of the seasons. Amazing. So this one, this is Ren's house. Probably need to do a bit more, like... Uh, I say I need to do a bit more decorating. It's actually not a bad house. Let's have a look at this one. This one will be, be very... It seems like when they move in, they get uh, a bit of wallpaper and stuff nowadays, which is quite nice. Nice to have a free wallpaper. Um, I've got quite a few butterflies hanging around, so I'm going to go catch them. Because I totes need the money. And it looks like we are saving up for a silver pickaxe right now. Oh yes, that's the thing though. Is uh, I don't believe Sally has any silver bar, a uh, silver silver pickaxe recipe for us at the moment. So I don't know if that's going to be coming along soon. Look at my cute bridge. I love it. It kind of does look more like the banisters for stairs, but I, I don't care. Oh, this one's done too. Oh, okay. So we can get two move-ins done today. If we can go and get some stuffing and um, the stuff for our lantern. Okay, let me just double check. I might have the stuff for a lantern already. I'll have to see. Okay, so... No more tools at all. One thing that I might do though is um, I'm gonna go. Of course not. It's, I'm not looking at Sally's buy. I'm looking at what I've already bought. Sorry. Ignore me. Ignore my silliness. But what I think I'll do is buy the silver. Oh, I can't. Oh, maybe I need to buy the silver bar recipe and make a silver bar before. The game is going to let me have a silver pickaxe. We'll have to see what happens there. Like, it's not the end of the world. At the moment, um, I can now make the bulbs that I need. I can now make light bulbs um, and I can make beautiful lights and things like that. We've got now hedges that we can put outside people's houses. There's all sorts of cool things. Loads of furniture, topiary trees that I can put in people's houses as well. It's all very cool. So I am I am quite happy with that. I'm quite happy that I've got most of the things I need to make most of the stuff. It's just I don't have um, silver, gold, and diamond. So we're still just working on those. But I think today we want to be really working on, as I say, getting those two houses up and running. In fact, oh, I just need to go and get some wood. Okay. Oh, hang on. Do I have enough for two? I'm definitely going to need stuffing, and I probably have enough fibre, so I need to get six stuffing. Oh, I need another thing of glue. Okay, six six stuffing and a piece of glue, and then a whole bunch of wood. That shouldn't be too hard. But yeah, I kind of wanted to see if I can unlock all of the mines. Um, obviously, if the, the new sh Oh, that looks pretty! Books! Bookshelf wall. That's classy. I have no money, though. Oh, Shelab! Buy my stuff, please! Buy it all! It's only like three butterflies, but I don't care. Give me a bit more money than I've got at the moment. Okay, so I need some glue and I need six pieces of stuffing. Luckily, they're cheap. Oh, now I don't have any money at all left. I think we're going to have to have a bit of a money-making sesh today. How much are, like... I've got 15 silver there. 17 iron ore. I might be able to, like, make up some iron ore and and some silver ore and things and just go maybe go back to the mines as well although i need to make mining lanterns as well oh i need wood for everything yeah let's just go chop down every tree in the whole place right then. 
any tree? No, I don't have any tree things at the moment. We've had all the trees over here, except maybe, maybe I'll be able to chop that one down. Maybe. You guys are saying to leave the stumps. Like I was saying, I think it was last episode or episode before or something. Whatever I do with stumps, it's always the wrong thing. If I if I leave them, I'm meant to meant to dig them up. And if I dig them up, I'm meant to leave them. It's a nightmare. Tell you what though, this, this video uh, is a little bit late. Sorry, not sorry. Because uh, I spent the day outside in the beautiful sunshine. And now, now I'm getting depressed now. I'm like, good grief, you know. <laughs> is this the weather for the rest of the week? Probably. Um, this this is this is probably what's in store for me for the rest of the week. So you can you can understand my desire to be outside enjoying sunshine right now. So that's what I've been doing. That's why we're possibly going to be a bit late with this. I think I started recording this about quarter past four. Once the once the wind got up, the sun started to go in a little bit. I wrote my name on a stone in the mine the other day. I hope archaeologists in the future discover it and wonder who this famous Nico was. Ooh, hi, I'm so pleased to meet you. Hey, um, I know you're busy. Maybe you could help me with a thing. No! I wish you could, like, refuse something like that sort of... Oh, man. I'm being bad with my bug net now. You could re refuse that sort of request because, and and then they could have some time to think up a new one because, oh my goodness, it's a nightmare. Oh, hello. I've got some new stuff available. Come on by and have a look. Now that is definitely new. Uh, do I go back by Sally's again? Because that definitely wasn't there before. So I'm super duper interested. I love how like on a horrible day like this all the lights are on in their houses. Okay, let's go and... Uh... I need the butterflies. They're, they're good good for my money, okay? Which I have none of. Look, I've got eight gold right now, okay? Need the butterflies. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna get in here. And I'm gonna... I wanna make some mining lanterns if I can. Ugh, I can only make one at the moment. One is better than nothing, though. Sally, what are your new things, then? I may have already seen the new things. But certainly not anything. Okay. I don't know what the new thing was. Was it a new large object, single seated chair, two seated chair, table, bed, light, short stairs, small bridge. Mm. seemingly very functional anyway might have been some of the new topiary plants or something I don't know because I, I, I went through all of this earlier on there, I think there were some new trees and decorations and things like that I don't think some of the bushes were there before like that one I don't think that was there before But yeah, okay, so so no no silver things. Okay, that, that that's fine, that's fine. Let's um craft me two How many fabrics? Three. Six fabrics then. 
Ah, I need more grass. Okay. And then... I can make one wooden plank. I need loads more than that. I need two at least. Okay, well, let's go chop down another tree uh, if I can find one. Oh, there's a few next to Sally's still. Okay, let's get these. These ones are weird because they grow back whether there's a stump or not. They seem to just come back like every day. It's very odd. I'm going to chop down them on either side if I'm allowed to. I'm allowed to chop this one now as well. Okay. The trees outside of Sally's are so bugged. So, so bugged. Okay, time to get some grass. So let's put this away. And pick all the grass. No! Maybe we'll leave... That one might need a reposition. Obviously the house was there second. The grass tuft was there first. And that one was a, a flower. Quite a lot more grass up in the forest as well if I need it. That's probably enough. I only need a couple of bits of fabric. So I'm hoping that'll be enough to finish off my things I need. Which is a, a futon and a paper lantern in each house. Um, okay, so two paper lanterns. Done. And done. And need two more pieces of fabric. Done. And then I need two futons. Done. Right, so that's the two houses ready. So I'm going to get um, two new villagers today, which is fantastic. So, yeah, now we do want to go in here. And I will be going back on, on all of these and uh, making the villagers some, like, proper beds and all that sort of thing. But I, I want each one to be bespoke. So to start with, they're just going to get the... The standard package of a light and a bed. <laughs> and let's move. What a horrible day for them to move in, though. I think I want a new sheriff in. I think this town needs a sheriff. So we've got two, four, six, seven people waiting to move in. And we've already got four. So we, there's a few still to meet, definitely. There we are, it's Fiore, or Fiore, moved in. And then we're also going to move in, I say, I th I'm definitely, th no, oh, that's Ren's house, oops, sorry. Sorry, Ren. Um, it would help if I put the bed and the, the lamp down first. Then once I've got these guys moved in, I'm going to work on making um, a enough money to get a silver bar made, just in case that's what the game is waiting for, to let me have my silver pickaxe. Poor Pip and Owen have been waiting for ages, though. And it's going to be a long time, probably, before I have enough money to move anyone else in. No, we're going to go with Chef. It's going to be a long time before I have money to move anyone else in because, quite frankly, um, it's taking ages and and to get money, and I need to get my silver um, able to be processed and lots of stuff like that. So I'm going to head to the mines now. I've got plenty of room in my inventory. I'm going to head to the mines and I'm going to dig up as much as I can up there. I'll, I'll put down the one extra mine lantern I've ma managed to make, but the more coal I can get, the better. 
And what better way to spend a rainy, rainy day than in the mine? Not surprisingly, on a day like today, I'm not finding a ton of butterflies. I mean, I'm surprised I'm finding any at all. It must be very hard to, to like, run around in the rain like this. I need to sell off my basic pickaxe, because there's no durability decrease in this, so I may as well. But yeah, as much as I do want some light in here, and I don't know whether paper lanterns might do the job, but uh, as much as I do want some light in here, I am going to use the mining lanterns as sparingly as possible at the moment to um, allow me to go around all the different areas that I currently can't get to. Or have to move a lamp to, to get to it in, in any way. Um, and then once I've done that, any leftover coal can be used to maybe like get the lanterns into a nicer placing. I noticed that a lantern was sort of back to front in the last thumbnail, for example, that I did. Um, so I'd like to just get them all nice and pretty. And honestly, I think that's something I need to do is like a bit of beautification, a bit of like making the, the villagers some nice furniture and all that sort of thing. I, I made a bed for Benny at one point, and I think I made a bed for... I don't even think I made a bed for myself. I think someone else got a bed. I can't remember who. But I'm sure that one was made from logs and one was made from planks. I do like the, the rustic log bed style. I might I might actually copy that for a couple of them. Because it's pretty cheap and easy. And then I'll just... Uh... But I might need to redo it. I don't know, because I might need to redo it and... Um... Because I've put a, a pattern on the bed. So I might need to make like a one without a pattern on it. Like just a white one, and then I can give them all different kinds of patterns as I unlock them, which would be amazing. Seems to be a lot of copper in here today, I think. I thought this direction was usually a lot of iron, but yeah, it must just be what the luck of the respawn, I guess. The respawn king, gods, or whatever are with me today. So I think... Okay, that's, that goes down there. There's a rock there. Okay. I do need, kind of, a mining lantern there, but I kind of don't want to either. Because it is literally only one rock. And you kind of can get to it. I'm wondering if I can move this one a little bit more. No, I think I do need an extra one. <sighs> okay, well, we'll try. Um, I'm going to head down into this one, and then I'll come back up and I'll do the other side of that, of that one. Yeah, this is uh, definitely difficult with the, the amount of uh, mining lanterns I actually have. Um, so, I say it is something I kind of need to do. And I believe back here there's sometimes a... Uh, Silver. I've got lots of coal now though, so we can definitely work on these uh, mining lanterns. We can definitely, definitely work on them. So how much coal have I got now? 14, so that's like another seven. No, it's not, it's three per, isn't it? So that's like another four or five. Five now. Now I've got 15, it's five. So 
So another five of them might be enough just to light up those little areas that I'm not getting round to at the moment because I don't have enough light. And it's just so, so annoying having to move these lanterns around all the time. It's so irritating. So I definitely think it's something that I need to prioritise doing. Can I move that into a bit more of a, a nice position? That's probably the best I'm going to get there. That one, I feel, is in a good place. But I think it could rotate that way, maybe. That one definitely needs to rotate. Just to make it look a little bit more sensible. And where I can move them over to the side and make them look sensible, make them look like they're actually they actually belong there, I will do that. Well, it looks like some of them just don't want to place in a sensible way. So I guess that's just tough sometimes. Yeah. That, they're just seeming a little bit more sensibly placed now. Um, so I'm going to head back and I'm going to go and make more mining lanterns. I'm trying to light this place up a bit more. And I'm going to just position them all a lot more sensibly as well. So like I like where that one is, for example, but, but a lot of them are in silly, silly places. Like I say, around here I often miss things because, uh, like that, because they're just not, and that, because they're just not lit up very well. So definitely something I want to be uh, working on. Got to run all the way back now. No, not that way. Not that way. No, it is this way. Definitely want to get more mining lanterns and uh, more money. So I'm going to kind of split. Oh, are the emperors out now? Because they're good money. Yes, they are. Good time of day. Half past two. Good time of day. Catch butterflies. I'm not actually good at catching butterflies, but it's a good time of day to try. <laughs> okay, so let's see if there's any more about. Should I berate myself or then I catch it on the first try? Okay, I think that's enough. Yeah, mining lanterns actually do sell for a good amount. If I do get to the point where I've got lots and lots and lots of coal, might be worth it. Hmm. I knew it would be a small blue. They're so annoying. They're, they always look so tempting and interesting, and then they're like, no, I'm a small blue butterfly. <gasps> Yay! Sorry, like... I know I've got a big plan of things to do, but... Oh! 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 Well, hello. I want to look good. Sweetie, a new makeover will cost you 40. I'm afraid it looks like you don't have enough. Come back later when you're a bit more flush with cash and we'll fix you a splendid transformation. Oh! Little shoes and jackets and shirts and trousers that don't look like bricks. Oh my goodness, I love that little tan thing. Ah, uh, Loris, you've made my day. You've made my day. Okay, all right, let's go sell some butterflies. 
And I should be spending it on getting silver, but I want to spend... Okay. Someone will be very happy with me. Okay, I'm just going to sell these butterflies. I have about 100 things I now need to apparently uh, spend them on. I caught 15. Wow. I was going some, wasn't I? Okay, so that should be enough for a makeover and the mining recipe, I think. But I'm also going to be, be buying some of these seeds here. No. Get out the way, Moss! I need to buy green flower seeds. I need to buy a lot of them as well. Like 20. I don't care if it costs me 100. I'll just go catch some more butterflies, but oh my goodness. I've been waiting. So now I can actually accept Tola's request. Yeah, I'm going to plant them here, I think. There's lots of space. Mostly because I've chopped down all the trees. I do need to buy some conifer seeds as well, ideally, I think. I wonder if you have better luck with um, digging up clay on a rainy day. that one. I won't be able to see it and then I won't know it's there. And yes, I am still being quite random with things. Um, I'm, I'm trying to be a bit more like natural rather than everything everywhere. So rather than like little fields of things, you know, actually I am trying to do everything everywhere. Now, if I dig that straight up, will that be... Well, I'm going to go and accept the quest anyway, because I'll have a few days to do it, and they'll be grown in, like, three days. And I feel so bad. Like, Tola was literally crying last episode. Probably because there was no, no green... Because it couldn't help with the request. And they were crying. And then I felt so bad. So if I can do this now, then that's great. Well, that should be enough right now. I'll just fill in all the holes. I've got a few left, but I'll maybe plant them on the other side of the river. But there's a bit more room. Okay, so I'll have lots of green plants there. Lovely. I might eventually have to dig everything up and make it a bit more, like, uniform. Because eventually I'm probably going to have trouble... Uh, fitting everything in so it might eventually be that I have to be a bit more organized about things <laughs> you don't want to be caught do you That one got caught on the second swipe. That's not too bad. All right, let's go see if we can find Tola. Maybe in the house. Home of Tola. So, yes, eh, you are at home right now. By waiting for this, um, to, to accept it until I had the plants planted, that now means that I've got time for them to grow before I have to hand this in. So I've got five days left for them to grow. I need to give Benny a table as well. So I'll need to work on that in the next couple of days as well, but, uh, no massive rush. Now, we only have 43 left now. So I kind of think I need to go sell my butterflies again. How many have I got? Six. 
and my wormy squirmies. And I need to make mining lanterns. But the next thing I want to get is the silver recipe and then by the end of the episode I would love, 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 I want to sell all the butterflies. 85. Sell my wormy squirmy. I'm going to sell that yellow petal. How much does silver ore go for? Six. So iron ore only goes for two. So it's actually quite good. I should make some more like um, stone shovels and things like that maybe. Or just like even the stone walls. I've got a lot of stone again. Like every time I go in the mines I get loads of stone. So it's good to just make that into something that I can turn into uh, money really. I might have just enough to make silver bars and I think if I can make silver bars it's probably going to be worth my while this is where it takes like three silver and it's only it's worth like eight, 19 or something or 20 have to catch the butterflies everywhere I go have to catch them, have to catch them, have to catch them have to catch them all, have to catch them all Swiping in the same place isn't going to catch it any better. That was the rubbishest song ever. See, this is what you're missing in the post -com. I don't think it... Well, I maybe did a song. One of my rubbish made-up songs. So I'll have to do a remix one day of all of them. Right, so Sally, I would like to start processing my silver, if nothing else. So can I please, please, learn how to make, oh it's 95, right let's go sell those butterflies I just had, it's probably going to be enough, or maybe I should just go across the bridge and then do a little bit more butterfly catching just to make sure that I've got enough. Right, so, oh good, some of the trees are growing nicely now. I think I have a conifer seed here, look. I'm just going to stick that in that uh, spare spot I've got there. I'm just trying to put them kind of out of the way at the moment. Some of the ones along here have grown as well, which is quite cool. Yum! So I really, really, really am hoping that um, unlocking silver bars might be the the key, <laughs> maybe, to unlocking a silver pickaxe. It would make kind of sense. It might also be random. And I'd need to do a few more villager quests first, but I'm on my way to doing those as well. So if I haven't managed to unlock the silver pickaxe by the time I need to make Benny the table, then, you know. In fact, let's go and, um, go and say hello to Fiore. Oh look, they have a little easel. It's so cute. You do your painting. And a guitar. I have a guitar. I like my guitar. I don't know how it's standing up without a stand, but... Magic guitar. Hello Hector, I haven't seen you in a while. How you doing? Hey, what's up, Shelab? Um Hey, what's up, Hector? Just collected some money for some to get us some silver so that I, I've unlocked one of the the last pieces of things I need. Last pieces of things I need. Hmm. Yeah. One of the last um bars that I need, and then obviously I'll need to go and get gold. And then I'll need to get diamonds. But gold and diamonds are the only things that I can't get right now. And obviously there's there's probably things that uh, need to be unlocked at Sally's. Um, quite a lot of things that I need to unlock at Sally's. And there's probably things like decorative things that aren't unlocked yet. And there'll be something new later on. Things are probably being added as the game develops and patches as well. 
like 120s worth of silver there. Right, that should be enough to do it, I think. And I would like to make a silver bar and see how much it sells for. Yada, yada, yada. Yeah, I've got 139 there. So I've got enough actually for a haircut as well. If I want one. A style makeover. All right. All right, Sally. Hello. Hello, Sally. How's it going? Very good, but I can't afford any of your stuff right now. Um, silver bar. And that takes two coal, okay. So, let's have a look. Coal sells for one, and silver sells for six. So, is it five silver? So it should be... To make silver, it's... Seven silver, or... Okay, so six times seven is what, 42? Am I right in that? I think so. Um, I'm just thinking, I'm just. Five times seven is 40. No, five times seven is 45. It's 52. Sorry, it's 52. No. Five times seven is 35. No, it is 42. Ah, the magic number and then so it should be 44 so yeah I'm gonna make a silver bar and I expect it to sell for at least like 45 41 so you lose money on that hang on I'm, I'm getting my I'm getting my calculator out I've got my phone here right okay so phone phone calculator All right just making absolutely sure so seven times six is 42 as I said I should have not doubted myself first time 42 and then the two coal is 44 so you lose money you actually lose money by making silver so yeah I'm gonna go just sell all the silver Absolutely, no need to be doing that unless unless when I craft with silver it's hugely expensive or something. But no, I'm just going to sell the silver ore straight off the bat until it gets unless it gets re rebalanced. So let's craft a few things for money and craft a few things for my mining stuff. So um, I'm going to make myself another five mi mining lanterns and that's going to be a big help. I think it was only five I could do with the coal I've got. Yeah, and also with the wooden logs I've got. Then I'm going to make some stone slabs. Make 30 of those. And I'll make like 10 stone walls out of that. Oh no, 15 stone walls. And we'll go and sell those. A good way to just get rid of your extra, your extra stone. I mean, you could build things with the stone walls as well, obviously. But I'm still very, very short on money. So I like to just use the things I get to... The, that I've got a lot, a big surplus of anyway, to do that. So I've got mines every day and harvest all the, the respawn stuff. Um, well, having made a silver bar, I'm hoping, I won't sell my silver yet because if the wonderful, lovely um, pickaxe suddenly comes up, I'll, I'll regret selling silver ore. So that's not gonna get sold for now. But when I get to the point where I have made a silver pickaxe, then, uh, you know, all bets are off. I'm going to be selling that all. I, I'll probably every so often just check on the price of a silver bar, but I expect it to be above 45 or it's not worth doing. Okay, you totally know now what I'm going to be doing. So I bought the silver recipe. And now I'm going to go for a makeover. And then once I've gone for a makeover, I'm going to go and make, I think, a table. Oh, how long have we been going for? 39 minutes. We've got loads of time, actually. I can make a table and maybe go and put the, the mining lanterns down. So, or maybe we'll just do the mining lanterns so we won't worry about the table for now. Hmm. Opening times. I do need to go check in there, actually. In fact, maybe I'll 
just check in there. Make sure there's no new people. I haven't, I haven't met a new person in ages, so... Oh, there is! There's a new person! See? Oleander. I thought Oleander was poisonous to dogs. That's like a, a total ironic name, right? I should have visited this village a long time ago. Back when Esther... Oh, oh, a love story! Oh... Esther would have loved it here. We always talked about moving somewhere like this. Still time. Perhaps you're right. It's never too late. And this place... Move in! A wonderful suggestion. I think I will. Just as soon as I've safely packed all my old records. Oh, Oleander! That's so cute! Okay, now we're going in the fashion store. And I do have enough money, hopefully, now to do a little makeover, please. Sounds great. Okay, so, finally. Wow, look at all these cool hair color presets and things. So, I don't need a preset, I need custom. I need custom. I'll get down to custom. This is how we do custom, with the mouse. Hair color custom. So we need lots of red and lots of blue. Hey hey! And take down the green. Oh no, maybe take down the red a little bit. Okay, oh I like that the eyebrows go with it. Nice. Eye color! Let's match it in. Ooh, they're really pink as well. Bit more blue. A bit more, I like a bit more blue to my purple. Skin colour I'm actually quite happy with. Okay, now hairstyle. Ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> That's so cute. That's really cute in purple. It wasn't as cute not in purple. That's cute too. I could have really curly hair. Oh, I like that one too. Oh, I think I found the one I'm gonna have. I don't know though, I'm kind of like not sure because of the ears. That hides the sticky out ears. So I think I'm gonna actually go with that one for now. We can always change it later, okay? So look, look at me. How much is this? 150. Pants, 150. White shirt, 150. Well, we'll keep coming in here and I'll be able to sort my wardrobe out. But oh, that makeover is so good. I finally feel like me. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's go to the mines and put all the mining lanterns in. Oh, I feel so good now. So we got two people moved in. We met a new person as well. I'm just trying to keep on making the money. I am proper purple she lab again. I don't care if that cost me 40. That's like a couple of butterfly catches. I might go, I might one day decide I want to have the little cute, the little cute buns that look like ears. I like them, but I like this one too. And I do think the sticky out ears are cute, but I do think it's a little bit more sophisticated, this look, definitely. Okay, let's go. I may as well have my pickaxe out. And like, I keep forgetting, like I've got no money, but I don't, but I'm like, I'm not selling that pickaxe, that basic pickaxe that I've had since the beginning, even though I've got a better one. No, no, no. Okay, so let's start down here. And I can just about get away with these being where they are. But I think it would be a lot better if, I mean, especially because there's a spawn right there. It would be much better to have that there. And move this guy up here a little bit. Okay, 
Yeah, you just about get away with that, so that's wonderful. I'm gonna rotate this one and pop it here. That one there. Oh, look at me wasting lanterns. Good grief. One right there. I'm gonna pop this one up against the wall there. Seems we've got like a million lanterns here. I don't even know if that one's needed. Particularly. I might stick that one in my backpack, honestly. You can just about get away with running around there and I don't think there's too much uh, activity around there either. So may as well just keep that until, I mean, I'll, as I say, I'll probably want to get a few more lanterns. I'll probably, this is so much better. Because I've kind of put the lanterns a little bit where the rocks are likely to spawn as well, which is quite nice. Um, but once I've got enough lanterns, I'll put some in the in-between spaces and really get this place lit up nicely. But at the moment, I'm just trying to get uh, as much coverage of the mines as possible so I can get as much mining done as possible each day. And that will mean I'll have more coal and that will mean I'll be able to make more lanterns. So it's it's circular, you know? And also more money, because I need money all the time. And uh, metals are a very good way of doing that. Silver, as I say, does seem to be better sold as ore. Um, iron seems to be slightly better. Uh, Money-wise made into uh, ingots. And I don't know how um, diamond and things like that will will go. Okay. So there was just this one annoying place down here that I do kind of feel that a, a lantern is needed. Um, it's just a bit annoying not to have one here. And then I might have another one in the corner. As I say, I would love to have the place like really well lit up, but I've only got another five lanterns right now. And I'd love to spend that just getting these, these areas done. I think that area doesn't have anything there and I think this area doesn't. So I'll eventually replace that with two lanterns. Um, but for now, I'm quite happy just with the ones I've got there. So I'm finding more rocks all the time just because they're in places I've not been able to get to because it's been too dark. Okay, so that will probably just need to go there. Just light up this corner. That is a, a bit of nothing, honestly. Okay, how many lanterns I got left? One. So I actually will put the two in. I'll put one over here. Hello, come back. I'll put one there and I'll put one like right into the corner over here as well. Maybe there or something. Still a touch dark and I would still prefer a few more lanterns, but it's okay. So I can definitely at least 
kind of see there's a few dark spots around that I'd like to uh, get rid of. But no, we're doing okay. So I think I think the mine is now good enough that I can see, but I would prefer to have it better lit if possible. I've now got I found another five coal in there. I'll probably come back a couple more times. Grab all the coal. If I can grab every rock in here every day, I should be drowning in coal. And then I can sell it and use it to buy nice clothes. Yes, I thought there was something on the ground there. And then eventually, hopefully, we'll be able to open the final one. The, fi the room over this side, I believe, leads to a diamond mine. Because there's gold boulders in the way. So every time I've had something like, there were iron boulders in the way and it led to silver. There's a silver boulder in the way, which I imagine is leading to the gold, which is, you know, in the bit where I mine silver. Um, so I imagine down here, that, that's got a bit of a goldy sheen to it. Uh, that that will be... I mean, I will just double check and make sure. <laughs> but I think that, that you need gold for that. So eventually we will get in there. I just need to keep going until till it reveals itself to me. But like I say, making a gold a silver ingot may be enough to uh Maybe enough to uh, allow Sally to stock that in the shop. And if that's the case, it's going to be great. I can't believe I've spent an entire episode. Like, did we even sleep? Has this just been one day? I think it has, but we did so much stuff. It's been like 50 minutes already. But just placing those mining lanterns, once you've done it, you don't have to do it again. So, well, as I say, I probably will rearrange them a bit and make it even brighter and lovelier down there. But for now, I think I'm going to... What's the time now, look? It's like half past ten. Sally hasn't said anything about new stuff, so if we have a fourth message in the morning, then we shall know. So I'm going to sleep until tomorrow. I will check the mail before I, before I log out, though. Just, just because I will. No, nothing from Sally. So I'm going to uh, call it there, I think. So next episode, hopefully the, the green flowers will be ready to dig up. And I will make a table for Benny. We'll go around everybody else and just check if there's anything that they need. Maybe do a little bit of decorating. Get some more bunny. Uh, sorry, get some more butterflies caught. Get some more money. Butterflies and money bunny. Uh, that's how my brain works. But anyway, so I, I'm hoping that you enjoyed the episode. Um, we now have lovely purple hair, so I'm sure you did. Look at the purple hair. Look at the purple hair. Look at the purple hair. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, then please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome. <laughs>